Russia is purposefully placing military facilities among civilians in Crimea. Russia is purposefully placing military installations near civilian areas in temporarily occupied Crimea in an attempt to deter Ukrainian attacks. On June the 23rd, the Russian Ministry of Defense said Ukraine launched five ATACMS cluster armed missiles at Sevastopol, according to a report from the Institute for the Study of War, ISW. The occupiers allegedly intercepted four missiles, but one deviated from its flight path and exploded. Russia later blamed the US for civilian casualties, despite admitting that a Russian air defense interceptor caused the missile to deviate from its flight path and explode. Footage released on June the 23rd purportedly showed civilians on a beach in Sevastopol during and after the missile deflected from its flight path. Russian sources claim that cluster munitions fell on civilians near the beach in Uchuevka Park in the northern Sevastopol. The Russian Ministry of Defense's accusations against the United States of civilian casualties are an attempt to deter the United States from providing further security assistance to Ukraine. Analysts note, Russian military bloggers actively criticized the Ministry of Defense and the Russian occupation authorities in Crimea for failing to prevent the attack and provide sufficient protection for the Russian civilian population. In addition, the sirens did not go off during the alleged attack. Several bloggers criticized Russian authorities for failing to detect and destroy all the missiles before they approached Sevastopol. In addition, there are no shelters near the beaches. As analysts note, video materials and photos indicate that Russian troops have been deploying military equipment in civilian areas of Crimea since the beginning of Russia's full-scale invasion of Ukraine. At the same time, the occupying Russian authorities are irresponsibly encouraging Russian tourism to Crimea, using it as a rear springboard. Experts speculate that the Russian military may be deliberately positioning military installations near civilian areas in Crimea in an attempt to deter Ukrainian strikes. Russian troops have been recorded using the Zaporozhye nuclear power plant and schools on the occupied mainland of Ukraine to cover Russian missile equipment. Russia is likely to be violating its own rules of application of international humanitarian law which state that military commanders should avoid locating military installations in or near densely populated areas, the ISW said. The anti-terrorist operation has ended in Derbent and Makhachkala cities of Russia's Republic of Dagestan where law enforces neutralized militants who attacked the Orthodox Church and the synagogue, as well as the traffic police post, and killed the policemen, the Russian media reported. As a result of the operation, Four militants were killed in Makhachkala and two in Derbent. The hostages held in the church have been released. Special forces and armored vehicles were deployed in both cities. The relevant images were distributed on telegram channels. It should be noted that nine people, including seven policemen, were killed and 25 others were injured as a result of the attack by the militants. Thank <laughs> you.